This is Ethan Port from TIBCO Software. In this movie, you will see how to download and install the free spacebar tool from activespaces.tibco.com. You will also see how to create, manage, and browse spaces with Spacebar. First, open a web browser and navigate to activespaces.tibco.com. From the menu bar, select Tools, Spacebar. You see a description of Spacebar and a list of Spacebar functionality. Spacebar is a graphical user interface tool for viewing and editing Metaspace content, including the ability to create, monitor, and modify space definitions, and to also directly graphically edit data tuples in spaces. Select the download link to download Spacebar for your operating system. In this demonstration, we'll select the Windows 64-bit version. After the installer archive downloads, let's look at the contents of Spacebar. Inside the Spacebar archive, you see that Spacebar can be run as a standalone Java application or inside Eclipse as an Eclipse plugin. Now extract the Spacebar archive to any folder, although if you want to use Spacebar as an Eclipse plugin, then you would copy Spacebar to your Eclipse plugin folder. In this example, we'll just use Spacebar as a standalone application. Now you can just double click on the Spacebar application to launch Spacebar. Here you see the spacebar GUI opens. First, let's connect to a metaspace. We connect to the default MS metaspace with discovery string tcp colon slash slash colon 50,000. This is the first time we are running spacebar, so we are asked to allow network access in the firewall. We go ahead and add this new firewall rule for spacebar. We see the current metaspace members. Notice this behavior is similar to the ASMM and ASAdmin utility. You see the metaspace has three spaces currently defined. Notice that details are displayed in the Properties tab below. For example, here you see the Paint Space definition. You can also view details about each current Paint Space member. For example, you see there are two AS Paint processes running and each AS Paint process is seeding the paint space. Now, we drill into the people space definition and you see all the field definitions for the space. Notice the various options available for each space field definition, such as if the field is a key, if it is encrypted, if it is required or optional, the optional fields are called nullable, and if this field should be used as a distribution field. Space field options are covered in another movie and in the product documentation. Notice you can have multiple Metaspace connections open in the Spacebar GUI. You can also export and import Metaspace connections, which would also include the space definitions. Now you will see some functionality of Spacebar that is not possible in the current version of ASMM. Spacebar lets you visually define new spaces. This is a feature missing in the ASMM GUI utility. We create a new space definition in this metaspace. The space options are organized into tabs. We go through the space options and change any default values. These options are covered in other movies. Like ASMM, you can also browse the data in a space. Notice when we create space browsers, there are various time scope options. First, we browse the MySpace space with the snapshot time scope. Here, you can select a field in a tuple and change the value. But unlike ASMM, which is a read only view of spaces, in Spacepar, you can directly edit the space data fields and make changes to the space. You can also join the space as a seeder rather than the default behavior to join as a leech. Here we create a browser with the current time scope. This does not return any existing values. It will only show changes to the space. Browser options like these are covered in another movie. In this movie, you saw how to use Spacebar to monitor and manage spaces and also to create and modify spaces and their data. You can find more training material and other resources at activespaces.tibco.com, and you can communicate with other TIBCO users at tibcommunity.com, and you can find other training options 
at 10.tipco.com. Thanks for watching.